Hello everybody and welcome to a new video. This is going to be a recommendation video for all my viewers, but especially three people, Kenyon, Wyatt and Sean. It's going to be a lot of Dutch uh, black metal bands. I think they're all black metal, so eat your heart out. We're, but not all Dutch. We're gonna start off with one of the few um, bands that are not from uh, the Netherlands. This is Hots Barn from France. And I want to show every format in this video. So here's the cassette, it's the J card. And um, Hots Barn is a extremely raw black metal band from France and I discovered them while visiting a black metal concert in my uh, city city town and um, a friend of mine was uh, organizing the evening and he told me like Hans Barn is coming do you know them I said like no never heard of him and um, he told me the story behind the um, singer of the band and that's pretty fucked up because the guy is called Psycho his stage name and in real life he could have been called Psycho as well so I've met him I've talked to him and I bought all their stuff that they were having on sale at the at the gig for like 30 euros like three CDs t-shirt and one or two cassettes and guys check them out hot barn i put a link to every band in the description and let's go to a dutch black metal band called kjeld and this is their ep they're dutch but it's weird because they sing in a um, I guess old old Dutch slash uh, Frisian language and I can understand shit of it can't read it but the music is really really great I've got a cassette tape of them as well and a vinyl release is coming to my um, collection very very soon I still haven't bought it but they had a, a release in 2015 I guess and it was fucking great so guys Kjeld raw black metal let's go to this one Awon Aw Aw I believe it's called with their self title and Based off the album cover, you've guessed it, it's atmospheric black metal. And I discovered this random uh, recommendations on YouTube. And I thought, nice, this sounds great. And I visited uh, the Maryland Death Fest and I saw this for sale and I, was, and I remembered it was good. So I bought it and it was amazing. Not good, but amazing. So guys, check out Aeon. Of Aeon, Aeon. Fuck it. And the next few ones are going to be Dutch. This is Dystopia with Haat. Means hatred. And this is a Dutch um, black and death project. From the northwestern part of the Netherlands. And this is... Drop it. This is one of the um, earliest CDs I bought from uh, a band themselves. So, and I do believe they still have some copies left. It was released uh, years and years ago, two years ago, <laughs> in 2014. So, guys, if you like a bit black and death metal, check out Dystopia. And. We go to one of the bigger names in Dutch metal, Dutch black metal. Fluisterbout met 
with just say the Dutch word. Um, Flush the wild with langs galg en rat. And galg means gallow. So this is a raw black metal band from the Netherlands. And I love the the style of raw black metal they play. I've been searching for the vinyl on um, Discogs and I found it many many times but God knows why I don't buy it. Up to the next one is called Geesteland, Ghostland and everything that I show is gonna be in the description as well. It's a three track EP and I believe it's their only um, how do you call it? Official release. They they've got some splits, but I really dig this one. It's called Grim Funeral, and the only thing I don't like about it is it has those the stripes. The, these I don't know why, but they're fucking cool. And the funny thing is, I've got a split tape. This one with. Terdor is going to be um, in my uh, recommendation as well. So guys, check them out. Uh, Geesteland, Ghostland. I'll put a link in the description as well. Let's go to the Shiva Hypothesis. It's a mouthful how we say it in the Netherlands. This is their promo 2015, and. The guy, the guys contacted me, and at first, first glance at the artwork, as I always do, was a bit disappointing. But as we say in the Netherlands, schijn bedriegt. An amazing promo. It has like three songs on it, but it is an amazing um, experimental black. Black and yeah, just take black metal, just experimental black metal, and check them out, guys. The Shiva Hypothesis. Okay, I'm done with the vinyl uh, CD. Let's go on to the vinyl. This was a release by Wederganger. It's called Half Vergaan Verwaakt, Ontwaakt. Sorry. And it has been released by Fun Records. A really nice, um, how do you call it? Uh, male, old, uh, old style of male. You, you know it. That's the feeling you get. It comes with a poster, the artwork, and on the back side, some other artwork. And comes with a booklet as well. Very nice. With some pictures and lyrics and stuff like that. I really like this one. Really fucking sick picture. And as I'm a sucker for colored vinyl, this was the other color next to the standard black vinyl and I love 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 this color a grayish blue and it's not raw black metal it's um, it has some atmospheric elements but also some raw black metal amulet influences so if you're a fan of both genres check them out and I don't know if you still can get this version at Bond Records I guess they do but I haven't checked it out so take a gamble let's go to Terdor which was on the split with Geesteland and 
this has been in my uh, collection for a very very long time and because the, uh, I was reviewing their uh, online um, uh, digital version of their album just some black vinyl by the way and they told me like do you have a vinyl player and I was like uh, no, not yet but I'm going to start collecting vinyl someday I guess and they said like ah for a few years we'll send you the, uh, the vinyl and I was like yeah nice so atmospheric black metal with a tad of raw it's good <laughs> and let's go to Ode of Ode and I've seen it in one or two videos and they were really excited about it and same as I trust me this is um, raw black metal at its best this gets a lot of spin time on my table this is the insert with some lyrics and not just lyrics just on black didn't came with anything I guess nope nope and I pre-ordered this from no, I didn't pre-order it I bought it from Haydn's Heart which is a um, very well respected and well known um, Dutch uh, black metal label so if you still want a copy of Schimmenwoud by Ode please contact them the next one is also Dutch and it's called Nachtvorst with stills and it's in my record player now so I can't show it Games comes with a poster yes this way around nothing special just the logo and it's um, suicide of black metal and I randomly found this I didn't know anything about this band so for 12 euros I think or 10 euros I bought this record and need us Need I, eh. Do I need to say more that it's on my player right now? Great guys, this is by the way the back side. Next up. Hekel. With the Dodum Fart. Dodum Fart, yeah. It's a gatefold. It's also raw black metal. Most Dutch um, black metal acts tend to be raw black metal instead of atmospheric black metal. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think they do. Just on black. Really simplistic artwork. I've got the CD version as well. And the other album hasn't been released on vinyl, but I still had to pick this one up and I really love to collect some more of uh, Heiko but I don't think they've got some more but they've got some material any left but we'll see this is called Dodenkrocht with Misery Chord I have shown the CD version of this and I think I told about that I had the vinyl uh, version as well. So it comes with a sheet with alternative artwork just on black. And this is, and I told it a few seconds ago, an atmospheric black metal band from the Netherlands but doesn't focus that many on the uh, atmospheric side focuses more on the black metal side and fucking great Misery Chords by Dodenkrocht then to 
a German band. This is Cold World. And I don't know why, but I don't see this in many videos. And it always uh, surprises me when I do. And I fucking love this. It's just some black. Plain. And um, this has a special place in my heart because it's the first atmospheric black metal album that I've bought and listened to and um, yeah it, it, it's peace of mind and I will never ever sell it and I really want everything from Cold World and love this one and up to the second to last one if I'm saying that correctly and this is a better known underground Dutch band called Bestial Summoning with The Dark War Has Begun and many 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 Dutch um, old school black metal fans think that this is one of the best Dutch underground black metal bands there's ever been and I can't agree with them because I'm not an old school black metal uh, old school Dutch black metal fan but and they told me dude if you see this buy it just on black you won't fucking regret this and you can't get any rower than this period I love this one just sick artwork I love it just simplistic simplistic artwork love it and the last one and this is gonna be pointed out to you Canyon you are gonna love this one it's Grafjammer with uh, Smerenburg. It's their 7 inch and um, it's their first release and just on black. Small inner sheet with lyrics and stuff. And um, it's blackened. Um, yeah, blackened hard rock. And with a very very raw and awesome voice and trust me canyon you will love this check it out please have my word and everybody else as well but i think canyon digs is more than other ones so that was i think my recommendation video for you guys and I hope you discovered some new bands. And if you like what I've just done, please send me messages. Tell me like, hey Bono, I fucking loved it. So thank you. Okay. And this is my video. Goodbye. See ya.